Having a healthy family dynamic is extremely important in raising a child. Having a good relationship between parents and children is probably the most impactful thing to someone growing up. It, and that's not groundbreaking new information here. You know, this isn't like an episode of Rugrats where I'm coming at you like Dr. Lipschitz here dropping all of this wisdom about raising children. Everyone knows this. If your parents come home from work every day and crack open a cold brewski, kick sand in your face and call you mean names like dweeb and tell you you're ugly, it's just not an optimal environment to be raised in. And you know what else is an awful environment to be raised in? The household of this Sopranos actress. There's an actress named Drea De Matteo who just went... I'm, I'm sorry if I butchered her name. I haven't seen The Sopranos. Sue me. Sorry. I know it's like one of the most beloved television series of all time. I haven't seen it yet. But this actress from The Sopranos went on a podcast and she mentioned that she lets her 13-year-old son edit some of her OnlyFans photos. Did you hear Drea De Matteo from The Sopranos just admitted that her 13-year-old son edits her OnlyFans photos? Your phrasing of that really isn't indicative of how she talked about it. She was proud of it. As if it was a normal thing. Yeah, I did see that. Here, I'll pull it up for you. She was on, like, a podcast and was talking about her OnlyFans work. And the question came up about, like, her 13-year-old, like, working for her. And she was like, oh, yeah, no, he yeah, edits my OnlyFans photo, so let's come talk to me about, like, Mom, what do you want me to do about this bikini line? And, of course, I don't let him see any of the other girl stuff or whatever. It's queen. You're doing girl-on-girl -girl collabs. Yes, because Oh, we I'm... are switching this pot up. Okay, <laughs> let's get... Blackjack okay. in Alabama. My kids are out there. I'm uh, sorry, yeah, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm oh, really sorry, wait, but they know. They know who their Before mama you is. start, your son was outside saying he edits your OnlyFans photos. Oh, yeah. That is like, demented. Yeah, what do you do with the bikini line here? Yeah. That is just demented. The shamelessness is crazy. I don't know how that's not, like, a crime. It, doesn't that have to be some kind of, like... I guess I don't know what OnlyFans content she's talking about. But, like, if a 13-year-old is editing pornographic content, that has got to be illegal. So you don't have to apologize to them, I don't think. No, I but it. they don't see the girl the girl shot. I also cannot believe the response from these two. He's acting like this is some kind of normal thing. Like, I remember when I was a 13-year-old boy and my mom came up to me and said, Hey, son, you want to make a couple quarters this summer? Edit my porn. And I said, All right. Simple blue collar work. Put some hair on your chest. And then she says that she loves it. That's unhinged. That's, but I do go over that with them before I ever put them out. I was like, are you okay with this? Because it's like, Aww. if I were to do it in a movie, because I would do, I would make out with girls in movies all day long before I even make out with boys. Those? <laughs> names, names of, but really, I think the same Download way. Download for the plane. The same way that you tell to have your these conversations with your kids, I think you need to call me before you do it. All torch queen. So I haven't seen the full clip or anything. This guy seems kind of creepy, but this whole thing is absurd. So she's saying like, oh yeah, I'd make out with girls all the time in movies, you know. So I, I check with my my son to make sure it's okay. Like what? Having a thirteen year old edit your OnlyFans content has to be illegal. Like, I don't understand how in her rotted brain she thinks that those two things are comparable, where her making out with, like, other women on screen is somehow, like, even in the same ballpark as having your 13-year-old son edit your OnlyFans photos. Like, in those movies or whatever where you'd be making out with other actresses, your son is not on the director staff telling you to do it or editing the content. It's fucking gross. I, I don't know anything about this lady at all. All I know is that's some shit that should earn you a one-way trip to the slammer. I checked out her OnlyFans out of curiosity. She doesn't do nudes, but it's obviously still sexual content. Okay. Curiosity got the best of you. Did you, did you pay for it? <laughs> that's big investigative journalism. But it still doesn't change anything. Even if it's still not nude, editing sexual content is... Uh, having a 13-year-old edit your sexual content is absolutely foul her kids should unionize <laughs> that's so true i won't use any more photoshop on my mom's titties until we're paid a fair wage give us ten thousand more v bucks hell no i didn't pay i just found an archive of her only fans content with all her photos and videos hmm. sure you did mm-hmm Mm-hmm. 
She is full-blown loopy off that poopy. That is deranged. Even if she's not doing full nude content or full-blown porn, having a child edit any kind of sexual content is outrageous. I do not know how she is not in handcuffs from admitting that. I also decided to watch a little more of the podcast, and it doesn't really get touched on again. They kind of just gloss over that, even though that shit sticks out like a sore thumb. Like, I don't know how that wasn't pushed back on by the two other people there. They seemed very supportive of that statement, which is gross. But I decided to also look into a little bit more about this actress. And <laughs> this is what she had to say about doing OnlyFans. According to her, she initially wanted to launch it as a podcast hosted with her boyfriend that focused on politics and current affairs, saying, quote, we wanted to do it because we wanted to do it there because it wouldn't be censored and everything was being censored. We have no freedom of speech anymore. And then she started doing steamy content. And even though she's not doing full frontal nudity or X rated scenes, she has come to regard her OnlyFans work as a political statement. I had to give myself the narrative that this is the only way I can fight for my freedom right now, and that's basically to be naked. To be naked with my beliefs and my politics and what I want for my kids' future. And I think that people are so afraid right now to speak their minds. What kind of hullabaloo are you going on here? This is a buzzword after buzzword. What do you mean? To be naked with your beliefs and politics and what you want for your kids' future? Do you want your kids' future to be endlessly bullied? Like, your kids' future right now is a porn editor. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? Crazy lady snap back to reality. You started OnlyFans because you stopped being able to land any kind of meaningful Hollywood roles. Your kid's future was not top of mind when you started doing OnlyFans content and then hired them as your editor on staff. And I'm using the word hire super loosely because I bet she doesn't pay the 13-year-old. <laughs> Maybe she does. I don't know. Some kind of allowance or some shit. I have no clue. But this is so disgusting and what's even crazier is this isn't the only time i've heard of this there was a video that went viral like a year and a half ago about a mother whose daughter was editing her only fans content for her and even directing and taking photos for the mother for her only fans content that's so fucked up i don't know how it's happened not once but twice now like it makes no sense to me how delusional can you possibly be to try and spin this as some kind of wholesome fight the power narrative here like how, how can you in any way look at this as anything positive like what fucking statement are you making about being naked or doing whatever sexual content you do on only fans even though she says that this is her her way of you know getting back to get naked that was her words so does she get naked on only fans i don't really know but what is confirmed is that she has a 13 year old edit some of the content for her that's fucking crazy. That is a lunatic right there. Like, what is the political statement you're making? Child labor, two thumbs way up? Like, what? Children should be able to edit sexual content? Like, what statement are you making, weirdo? It's so fucking odd. All right, listen, son. Mommy's gonna go get finger banged on camera. I'll make sure to write down timestamps for you to highlight the best moments for OnlyFans for the montage. I feel so bad for her son here. I feel so bad for the kid in this situation. But yeah, I had to talk about this a little bit. It's another brain-rotted Hollywood celebrity doing gross shit. That's about it. See ya.